it's me Paige again. Welcome to another video of the week. Today, this is going to be a video you guys have been long waiting for, which is my back to school supply haul. No, I ha I should have posted this video first, but I pre-filmed a lot of fun videos before you could see this one, so you guys get a little excited. So today, we are going to be doing my haul, my haul for all my back to school supplies. This video is not sponsored. I am not bragging in any way. I don't really know how you can brag in back to school hauls or any haul really. Target and Walmart have the best school supplies ever and they're cheap and affordable and also cute. So why stop chit chatting? Let's get on to this video. <laughs> So the first thing I have for back to school are my wonderful, wonderful flashcards. Flashcards, if you did not see my study tips from in my last channel, I said flashcards are the best thing to use. And I just get the ruled index cards from Up and Up, the very original brand that I usually only see in Target apparently. So I got the ruled index cards. So I got the Up and Up ruled index cards index cards. Next, I got the wonderful, wonderful binders. In all my classes, I have to have at least one binder in every class, and I love getting original binders, and I just got one pattern one because I know that class I would not need to use it that much, so I might use it again next year. So I got all of these binders from Target, and this binder is a very floral, printy fabric one, and this is from Green Room, and it's a one inch binder. I got two binders, one one inch, and I usually get white binders, so I want to design them on my own, which is very creative of me. I know, I'm weird. I like DIYing my binders. So I got the white ones. I got one red one, which is an inch, inch, and all these binders that I'm showing you, I didn't mention. They're not the recycled ones, they're the up and up brand. Actually, the binders are all not the same brand, sorry. And which is very original from Target. And I got a purple one, and this is not up and up. This is an Avery Durable Clear Cover one. So the next thing I got are these graph paper from Five Star. Five Star actually has the best graph paper ever, or just regular wide wool paper, because they have this plastic thing on the side and the paper barely breaks. Next, I got a bunch of five star wide ruled paper and I have one, two, three, four, five, six paper because it says to get a year supply of paper and trust me, I go through paper fast because maybe I write video ideas in class which is kind of bad but I need this paper. Next, I got some letter index dividers. I did not want it this year to be to get very cute ones because I want to be very affordable. And these were like 77 cents. And I got one, two, three, three with five dividers and one with eight. And these are the up and up brand. Next, I got some locker accessories. If you do not know, I do not decorate my locker since at my school we're not allowed to decorate my locker. But if you do not follow me on Snapchat, you should follow me on Snapchat. All my links will be down below. I just noticed I did not put all my links down below ever in my videos. I'm very sorry. But I have a locker at my own house, which is very ridiculous, but I use it for my clothes actually. So I wanted to decorate that locker. So what I got is the mix and match wallpaper that's magnetic for locker and this is from locker style next i got the locker style fringe curtain which is also magnetic which is also really really cool and it's pink since my locker is blue i want to go bubble gum bubble gum cotton candy thing for my locker so we got everything pink last thing i got for my locker which is very helpful and i think very cute from Locker Style, which are text magnets, four sheets of them with 36 magnets, and they have little emojis and a little other stuff, so it's really, really cute. Next is my backpack. I put everything in my backpack that is like on my writing utensils, 
our notebooks and this backpack this backpack brand is not very common here I bought this in Las Vegas actually and this is the super dry Japan outdoor backpack and it's a very flory floral um, it's like a very blossomy blue dark backpack which is really really nice it's very big and durable so the first thing I'm going to be pulling out is my pencil pouch Pencil pouches are my need. I do not like having boxed ones. I do not like having, there are very cute ones at Target, but I need very big ones to store all of my supplies in it. So I got this chevron print with white and dark green, and it's a literally mint green color. And this is the Up and Up brand binder pouch. The next thing I've got is this is a need, and this is from Walmart, and it is the, the Casemate 3 hole punch. I've been seeing, since I have a binder, I do not have a hole puncher and it's very sad and it's very embarrassing to go up to the teacher and ask if she has a hole puncher. I need one for home to organize my binder. Next, I got these post-it page markers for, you know, dividers. Actually, those are not used for dividers, so sorry once again. Dividers, sometimes you can't write on them, so I will use these page markers. Next, I have a stretchable book cover that is jumbo size, and this is from Target. And it's a purple one. This is, this is for my social studies, and if you guys do not know, I love um, color organizing all of my supplies just to remember things when I put it in my locker. Next, I have this dark green two-hole pencil sharpener from up, the Up and Up brand from Target. Cause you need these. No one likes going in front of like in the middle of class to just sharpen a pencil. That is very awkward in my opinion. Next, this is my favorite pen brand actually. And it is the Pilot G2 Premium Gel Roller Gel Pens. We're not allowed to use gel pens at school. Okay, replay of what I just said. We're not allowed to use gel pens at school. We're not allowed to use gel pens at school, but I don't care at this moment. This pen, these pens are amazing. These are the red pens, and these are longest writing. I use these pens, this pen brand, for writing video ideas, for everything, and they are the best pens ever. Next, we have lots and lots of glue sticks from the Elmer School brand. You gotta have that disappearing purple. It's I get intrigued by that, and it's number one teacher brand. So I got the two of the mini glue sticks, and I have three of these large ones for you know. I don't know. I don't know what I use it for. Next, I have a bunch of highlighters. I am obsessed with highlighters. I have many many highlighters and this is the sharpie smear guard highlighters and this is the eight pack and it comes with pink yellow one orange one green one blue and one purple and i love this brand and it is amazing and highlighters are my favorite because i love highlighting things to make to make them pop out so i can study them better and love them. next we have the sharpie sharpie fine permanent marker which you kind of need these for everything so i don't really need to explain boys and girls i think you guys would know why you need a sharpie and once again another i got the blue of course i got the blue pilot g2 pens and these are the best things ever and they're gel so we got the blue pens of those Next, of course, this would not be a school supply haul if I did not have pencils. These are from Target, and these are the Up and Up Sharpen number two pencils. They're sharpened already. Everyone needs already sharpened pencils for those emergencies. Next, we have the Sharpie Precision Ultra Fine Permanent Marker, which, once again, did not have to explain for the permanent marker, so got this. Next, we have this really, really cute ruler. I love this ruler, actually. Do not, does anyone not remember in the 90s? I was not aware in the 90s, but I knew this was a thing. These slap bracelets. So it is a cat ruler, and I believe this would fit my pencil pouch because I wanted a ruler that could fit easily and but also be careful. 
And also, this ruler does not snap as easy when you think it is. These, this attacked Meg D'Angelo's in her video, but hopefully will not attack me in my video right now. So, I got this little cat one, and it's really, really cute. Does anyone not remember the slap bracelets from the 90s? I remember slap bracelets when I was in like 2007. 2010, like come on, everyone remembers those slap bracelets. Next, I got these high polymer erasers from Pentel, and I swear these are the best erasers ever. They can erase anything. I, you know, those pink erasers, everyone's like, oh, they work and stuff. No, they don't really. These are the best erasers to ever erase with. I recommend. Lastly, one of the Pentel Park supplies. I got these cute highlights like I get again I said I'm obsessed with highlighters and these are so cute these are from the U brand and there are three highlighters that are orange yellow and pink and they are look like nail polishes that is very very cute I I don't know it's so cute and next are the notebooks and folders so the first notebook I got is an emoji one from Mead Med Mead how do you say it I don't know and it has the emojis on it it has the they labeled the emojis apparently I didn't know they were named this the crushing emoji the sad emoji the homework emoji excited mm, food Monday happy don't talk to me and what and on the back, and they have more emojis, which is cute. And I got this. And I have a lot of these, to be honest. I am obsessed with notebooks. Next, I got another one of, you know, this one has the back of this. It's the same one, but it's back to back. So I got this notebook. I had to get that. It was very, very cute. This is my favorite notebook I got so far. It's a poop emoji. Throwing up rainbows. That is legit. So we have this poop emoji and it's very, very cute. And it has this little sticking out tongue emoji on the back. Next we have this other notebook and it has all the emotions for every single day of the week. Monday, crying, Tuesday, not properly. Thursday, well, Wednesday, smiley. Thursday, kissy face, Friday, excited. Saturday, heart, Sunday, yep. Next, we have a sketch notebook, and this is for art class. I got the dark blue one from You Create, and we have to have this for um, art class, which might be actually it might be fun in my opinion. So we have this sketch book. Next, we got many cute folders. These folders are really really cute, and these are do they say the brand Green Room? And I got, uh, all of them are gold with polka dots, and I got this, and Green Room, once again, I said, they are a recycled brand with, um, cardboard, which is recycled. And I got, uh, all of them are gold with polka dots, and I got this dark blue with gold polka dots, this black with gold polka dots, and this pink with gold polka dots. Sadly, this is the end of the haul. Hoping you guys like this video. If you didn't, I'm very sorry if you did not enjoy this video. But I hope you guys like this video. Thumbs up. Make sure to comment down below any more video ideas. Also, like I said again, all my links are down below if I did not, did not put them down there for a while. And also, make sure to read the description. I There are little surprises. I give announcements away, away in my description, which you guys might be interested in. So, I hope you guys like this video once again. Please click the red subscribe button to be subscribed. And also, when you click the subscribe button, you'll get notified every time I make a video. I do not have a designated fill, um, posting day, but I post a video every single week. So, I will see you guys next week, and bye! bye.